Hey people, it's your old pal Gabe. So, here's the thing. I'm going to read y'all, um, I haven't done it in a while. I was supposed to, um, I'm going to make a, basically I'm going to read y'all. Oh, people are going to get situated here. Ugh. So, basically, I'm going to read y'all a Loggers World magazine, or I don't really know. Everybody's kind of wondering, what are you going to do today? Well, I don't know. I'm really not feeling like really doing nothing right now. I don't know. I'm kind of in a lacy mood, if you will. Uh, fuck. I don't know, people. I'm kind of really not feeling like doing that much right now. I don't really know. I'm trying to look for a log trucker magazine to read. Trying to find one is like kind of fucking hard. All right. So here's the thing. I'll read you one. So this one is about a guy. His name's Cam Birdlogger. And his bird logger name is, last name is spelled, we already got the cam, C-A-M. And his last name is B-E-R-E-E-R-L-O-G-A-R. -E -E now this is the funny part. We're going to, we're going to kind of like dive into this basically. We're going to dive into him, his fucking, what he does, you know, and what he likes to do. So, we're going to kind of dive into this. <sighs> but anyways, I'm going to tell you all now. Make sure you hit the subscribe, like, and comment. If you really like me, hit that notifications. But if you like my videos, you know, hit the like button. If you really like my channel, hit the subscribe. Like I'm going to tell you all now. I've got one subscriber right now, and I don't know who the person is. I don't know. They might feel bad for me. I don't really know. Only one way to find out. Oh, here we go. Let's get into the story. I'm going to put you all on my lap, so I don't really care. All right, fucker. Camber Logger is a man of many talents. I'm a multitasker, he said. If there's one thing cons consistent with every every workday for a California log truck driver, dozer operator, sawmill owner, it's nothing gets m m mountain mountainous mountainous. I I equally enjoy running dozer, doing sawmill work, and driving truck. Bird logger said I, in my my profession, I'm never doing the same thing. For every sing every long, for very long, Birdlogger is a Yugoslavia last name is actually pronounced Birdlogger. Maybe the profession was fate. Yeah, his last name, uh, Yugoslavian. Okay, so his actual name is per, his actual last name is pronounced B E R L O G G E R Birdlogger. Yep, yeah. so like I said, it was fate. Creston Sawmill Bird Logger's base of operation is located in Creston, California, a town of just 94 peop people in the San Luis Obispo, Obispo County. It shares equipment and trucks with Bird Logger's other business, Bird Logger Excavation. It's not a logging area, and I believe I'm the only guy in the county with logging equipment, he said. To get get valuable redwood for his sawmill, Birdlogger makes a 380-mile round trip to Santa, Santa Cruz Mountains. With his self-loading log truck, he also has five dozers that he does excavation with in rural area and also hires them out of the state's forestry department and to battle what 
battles to Afro of California summer blazes. Everybody's wondering what does he mean by blazes? They mean fire. In all the in all his years working, he's been self-employed for the entire entire time except for measly six months. For measly six months. Getting started, Berlager graduated from high school in 1984 and went to Cal, Cal Poly where he got his degree in, in 1990. I, always mechanically inclined, he set out with his own mobile truck to repair business in the early 90s and then eventually shifted to heavy machinery. Sorry, people. In 1997, he bought his first small small dozer and that at uh, and that operation just continued to grow in 2004 he bought uh, some land and to build a house with a stand of dead pine timber he began chainsaw milling with his steel 045 a few years later prior he had done some chainsaw milling with a friend of and fellow lawyer Todd Peterson, owner of Breezewood Lumber Company in, Gre in Geyserville. So I bought a two-foot Grand Berg and old steel 45 and got to work. Berlogger said Creston Sawmill just grew from there. Berlogger had an entire ent entry-level band mill and eventually purchased a custom timber cane band mill that can muscle through logs up to 32 in diameter and 24 long. To get the custom mill, he drove to Missouri and encountered eight tornadoes along the way. They would have the three-year warning warranty and take over, take very good care of the people that that owner owned their their M A. So we got to go to page eight. So here we go. Oh, here's the cool thing about Birdlogger. He has a the Roaring Twenties. In 2016, Creston Sawmill updated its equipment to handle the delivery needs of it, of its customers. He purchasing this 1929 Ford A model, A Ford Model A Roadster pickup. That's something you don't see every day. Trust me, people. I, I've seen plenty of trucks, pickups, but not a Ford Model A Roadster. <sighs> Let's keep going. Machines, he said. Now the Creston Sawmill has expanded to a 1972 Kenner self-loader, the band and the circle mill forklift, nine chainsaws and six-foot grant, and bird cut-off saws, air-drying sheds, Log decks, log cats, chokers, a hundred feet of saw chain, large collection of mis mis miscellaneous uh, log and lumber handling equipment. Okay, so let's keep going. Demanding for redwood, much like he was workload things. Birdlogger gets asked asked to do uh, asked uh, workload. The things Birdlogger gets asked to do as his sawmills varied. Well, well, bar, bar tops and tabletops are the hot seller right now. He he also sells black walnut mantles, wood furniture. Shelving panels for sailboats, decking for equipment, trailers, and much more. Creston's sawmill cuts redwood, Douglas fir, ponderosa pine, Monter Monterey pine, digger pine, cedar cypress, poplar, pope, lar, red oak, white oak, black, black walnut, and whatever cust customer shit. Whatever customer, whatever customer brings to bird logger from the yard, their yard. Anyways, people, we're gonna have to make a second video to read this because this story is pretty damn long.
So I will see you all here in a few minutes. Bye.